Alright, so my name is Mike with Velocity Tech Solutions and this edition of Tech Corner we had a couple requests to clear the remote access controller or the DRAC card for the PowerEdge series servers. Um, this is, uh, the way I'm going to do this has been proven through Windows Server 2008 and 3. It might work with other versions of Windows Server but we're not sure if it works with Linux so if you have any input on that feel free to let us know. Um, what you're going to need is Open Manage Server Administrator Program from Dell. You can get that from dell.com slash support. Um, download that. Any version should work. We're going to go in once your server is running. And logging into this the first time, you have to set it up and do your things, but it should look like this. Then you're going to come to a screen that looks like this. This is the main home page of Open Manage. You're going to go and click on Main System Chassis. Scroll down to the Remote Access. And what we're going to see here is the IP of how to access the controller. Um, for some reason, if you've either forgotten it or lost the password to get into the card and change any settings, this, will, this, pro this procedure will clear that out for you. So now that we know what's going on here, we're going to open up command prompt. Start run CMD. And once inside, we're going to type in racadm.exe space rac reset cfg. Hit enter. And it looks like it did nothing, but it's just going through and resetting the card right now. It takes a little bit, a couple seconds, sometimes a few minutes. Go back up into Open Manage, refresh the page. If we scroll back down, currently it's clear, but if you refresh again, it, it should show a default IP. So once you've run the command, it should look a little something like this. The default IP for the DRAC card is 192.168.0.120. After you've done this, we're going to go over to any terminal that's hooked up to the network, assuming that the back of your server... So now that you're at the back of the server, you're going to want to make sure that you have an Ethernet cord plugged into the service port on the DRAC card, not to be confused with your main mix. So once you're at uh, any terminal that's on the network, we're going to go ahead and type in that IP address, 192.168.0.120, and hit enter. And this is going to bring us to the interface of the card through web. And now the default username for this has changed. It is root for the username. The password now is Calvin. C-A-L-V-I-N. Now that you're inside, you can go to the configuration tab. And you'll notice that this window looks a lot like Open Manage. And you can go ahead and clear and set anything that you want to do on your DRAC card.